Hey YouTube, it's Pegasus One, and today I thought I'd give you a quick update on my two goats, Buddy, this is Buddy, hi boy, and this is Bo. Um, you guys haven't really seen them in a while, and I know I've uploaded recent videos, well recently I've uploaded videos, but all those videos have been actually pre-filmed old videos from last fall and the end of last summer. So I wanted to share with you guys what they look like now. So as you can tell, they've gotten so much bigger. Hi. They've gotten so much bigger. Um, and a lot has happened since then. So Buddy has actually was sick towards the end of winter. He got a really bad cold and he had a hard time breathing and everything. And he ended up on antibiotics and probiotics. Um, he also got shots regularly for about a week, twice a day. Um, luckily, my mom knows a vet tech, so she was here to help us because, you know, these are our first ever goats, and we weren't sure how to administer the shots, and she really helped us and taught us how to do that. Um, also, they've actually gotten boils on their, chin, um, on their cheeks before, and it turns out they have CL, but the vet said it's not like a bad case of it, so they're still going to live a long, happy life with us. Um, we would only put them down if we knew they were in pain, and right now they're doing really well. Also, um, you may notice they're still in our garden, and this is because they have two pens. They have their nighttime pen with their permanent housing, their permanent housing structure, and a pen attached to that. And then this is their daytime pen, and it's also good because they're pooping and they're peeing in here, and that means it's really good fertilizer for when we do plant our garden this year. Um, they're going to be getting a pen put up in the backyard on the hill that we have, and our property goes pretty far back, so their permanent structure will be put up in the next couple weeks, which is really exciting. Um, Bobo, what are you doing? Uh, they're over a year now, just a little over a year. The shot, um, the shots, the vets came about three weeks ago, and they gave them their tetanus shots and that's so oh, they could get that before they're neutered and now it's three weeks after and today hopefully the vets will be coming and they will be neutering them which is really exciting because it'll cut down on the smell and if you don't know male goats smell quite a bit um during the springtime and summer and then over the winter they'll start to smell less and then as soon as you know they're back in season they're smelling up again and it's really gross in our yard so we're really excited to get them neutered it'll help with behavior too they'll just be a little calmer and they're very friendly i could get in the garden with them and play with them but it's a little hard to film like that um yeah and that's pretty much it also the vet came and apparently they're not pygmy goats um we were told they were pygmy goats and they're not she said they're some type of mix their coloring is black agouti, and they're definitely not pygmy, she said. She said maybe a mix of alpine is in there, though, and that's a type of milking goat, but obviously these are males, so we're not going to be milking them. <laughs> um, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick update of, again, this is Bo, and this is Buddy, and you can really see how much bigger they are, and... Yeah, and I'm really happy to report that everyone is finally in good health, and they're happy, and yeah, if you guys have any questions, ask me, and I guess you will see them next time after they are neutered. Alright, bye guys.